Hi, this is Christine. It is um, August 16, 2014. It's in the afternoon. And I posted a video this morning. And she's talking about love and what the Lord has been showing her. He's been transitioning her this weekend. And she's kindly and generously um, is sharing that information with us. It's about closing down shop. The Lord said that he's closing down the old shop and he's opening a new one. The old shop is the law, which is also the log, which is the beam in our eye. It's judgment. Not only judging ourselves, but judging others. Um, it's the old, the old law. It's sacrifice where we've been living without and going without, because that's what we thought we were supposed to do. It's also the prodigal. It's knowing the darkness so that you can appreciate the light. You know, it's like you don't really appreciate the sunshiny days until you have rainy days and see the difference. That kind of thing. And the new shop is the spiritual one of love and light, liberty, forgiveness, no judgment, no condemnation, just blessings, no sacrifice either. I've come to give them life and give it to them more abundantly. So you don't have to, there's no more sacrifice anymore either. You'll be able to move into having things. And not in the fleshly realm, but in the spiritual realm. Because remember, this is a spiritual transition and a spiritual house. When the Lord was walking on this earth, he said the Son of Man had no place to lay his head. He went without while he was still under the law. But after he died and rose and moved into the spirit realm, he gained access to everything. And I think that's what the Lord is doing to us now. He's moving us out of sacrifice, out of the law, out of judgment, and we're moving into the spiritual. We're resurrected, so to speak. So you go without while you're still under the law like he was when he walked this earth. Then you get crucified, you're dead and buried, you resurrected into the spiritual. And when you're spiritual, then you are no longer homeless or without. And I think that's what the Lord is doing. He's moving us out of sacrifice and into abundance spiritually. It's a transition. It's nice. To think about and it's just all it is is he's just telling us that's how, you know this is the walk that you've been on we're going to make a turn and shift and we're going to go a different direction so it's it's pretty easy just follow him just allow him to make that shift in you and turn the corner with him okay so we're going to get out of the old and into out of the old law when he was walking on this planet and now we're going to move into the new when he was resurrected and had access to everything. Um, also, you, when you go sightseeing you see little shops along the side of the road and some of them you go in, you know, you look at the window what they have there and that either draws you in to the store to look around or it doesn't. Well, the old shop that we're closing down is this one of judgment, law, the log, which is the beam in your eye, so you know, so that you're not judging your brother and you're not judging yourself either. So there's no more beam in our eye, there's no more judging, there's no more law, there's no more 
flesh. He's closing down shop. And what came to me is it's a going out of business sale. When a store closes shop, they go out of business. These are spiritual things, worldly, fleshly things that we're getting rid of. We're going out of business, guys. And then when we close down that shop, and just imagine that old shop is like a wood shop. You know, it, it's got wood walls, wood door, things like that. It's wood because it's the cross. So we're cleaning house right now. We're decluttering, getting rid of things like Anna said in two videos prior. Um, you know, you just go through everything and decide what stays and what goes. And I think that's what's going on with all of us. We're cleaning house spiritually inside of ourselves and we're getting rid of the fleshy stuff, the old things that, that we don't need anymore because we're going to be opening up a new shop so we're closing this one down some things you give away, some things you sell but we've got to go through all of our inventory in that old wooden shop, the wooden cross shop it's made of the plywood and then the Lord is actually the one who's doing this, he's the one who's leading us to make these shifts and these changes and then when um, it's closed it might happen on trumpets I'm not sure but then when we're all done it's the 40 days you know or the 50 days when we're all done cleaning out house then we're going to open up a new shop each of us and that new shop is going to be clear glass there's no wood it's just a glass new shop and all we're going to have in there is our spiritual, our new spiritual things all the old judgmental worldly stuff from the old shop is gone we've gotten rid of it, we sorted through it, we decluttered, we got rid of it and now the only thing in our new glass spiritual shop is things that are of spiritual relevance and importance so that's what came to me to going out of business sale guys we're going out of business we're closing down the old shop and then we're going to open up and the Lord's going to have each of us open up our own glass new spiritual shop and the 40 days are done or the 50 days because I know we have an extra 10 there so I'm not sure exactly when it's going to happen, but that's irrelevant. The fact is, that's what we're supposed to be doing right now in this time frame. So, um, that's what came to me. I don't know, hopefully it'll help somebody else, too. It's actually wonderful, because we're transitioning. Going from the old to the new. Don't feel guilty in the past if, if you have sacrificed and given things up because that's where you were at that time but now the Lord wants to move us into living in abundance and it's a spiritual abundance guys it's not the fleshly stuff he's going to move us into spiritual abundance whereas before we were having to go without so I thank you Heavenly Father for this and I Look forward to working with you to clean out this old shop and to decide what needs to go and what gets moved over. Praise God. Thank you, Father, and uh, thank you, everyone. God bless. Have a great day. Okay. Bye-bye.